crew, it's Miss Sagala here and my son, Daniel. I can skip count by fives using coins. And so today I took Daniel's play money, you get some plastic pennies here, and we didn't really have enough, so I also looked in my wallet for some coins and we checked out Daniel's piggy bank and we have a collection of pennies. And so we know that with skip counting, you can count in many different ways. Often, we count by one. That's one circle. But sometimes, we might wanna count faster ways by counting in groups of five, like that, or groups of 10, or even in groups of two. So today I'm gonna to show you some ways that you can use coins to skip count. With my pennies, I'm gonna make sets of five. Ready? One, two, three, four, five. I have a nice tidy row here of five. I'm gonna make another set of five right here. One, two, Three, four, five. Daniel, can you make some other groups of five? Okay. You might have watched one of the counting collection videos with one, another teacher. Two. You can three, definitely do counting collections with four, pennies. Five, eight, seven, eight, nine, ten. Daniel made a sort of 10 frame with his pennies. And I made mine up and down this way and he made this this way. It really doesn't matter. But to stay organized for counting, we're gonna put our collection all the same direction. So we have five, 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 and another five right here. Daniel, could you make a row of five here? Okay. So we're... Uh, we're And now we are going to label each set with a number. So let's start right here with one, two, three, four, five. So Daniel's writing five, and I'll place it right here with the first set of five. One, two, three, four, five. We could keep counting and see that the next set count. Five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. So what number should he write? This is five, and the next five makes ten. He's going to write ten. So let's count on. Ten, five, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen. So this set, we're gonna label 15. Five, 10, 15. Let's practice that counting on strategy. You don't always need to go back to one. So we can say 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20. And then 21. 22, 23, 24, 25. And in our last group, 26, 27, 28, 29, 30. Now we've labeled each set. We could practice our skip counting. So, Daniel, can you count with me by fives? Five, five ten, 10, 15, 20, 20 25, 30. 30. So that's skip counting because we don't need to go one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. We don't always have to count by ones. Mm -hmm. If we know that these are sets of five, we can say five, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30. Practice skip counting by fives at home. 
take a picture and send it to your teacher. Bye, crew.